Hello! In today's video, we're going to talk about IFT and how using it with your TP-Link router, you can enhance and simplify your everyday life. So what is IFT? IFT stands for If This, Then That. With IFT, you can create a recipe for just about everything. Choose a trigger and then choose an action. For example, a new device connecting to your network will trigger the action of sending an email notification to you. Or, say you have an S thermostat. You could trigger a specific temperature setting whenever your smartphone connects or disconnects from the network. It's that simple. So how do we make this happen? Let's begin. First, you would need to make sure you have one of our compatible routers. Check the link in the description below to see if your product is compatible with IFT. If you do have a compatible product, you will need to make sure it is connected to your TP-Link Cloud account. To do this, log into your router by opening our web browser, browsing to tplinkwifi.net, sign into your router, once logged in, click on basic, then click on TP-Link Cloud on the left. Make sure your account is connected. If not, please sign in before continuing. Now that your product is connected to your TPE Cloud, go to the IFT website. From here, if this is your first time here, you will need to sign up for a free IFT account, or you can sign in. First, you need to link the two services together. Search for TP-Link. Click on TP-Link Router, and click on Connect. Sign in to the same TP-Link Cloud account that your router is connected to. And click on Authorize. Now you're ready to use IFT. You can use any of the pre-made recipes by searching TP-Link Router or create your own. To create your own, click on My Applets and click on New Applet. Click on the blue This and choose your service. In this case, we'll choose Facebook. Choose the trigger. I'm going to choose your profile changes and I'm going to create the trigger. Now I'll choose the blue That. Choose your action service. In this case, we'll choose Gmail. I'm going to choose send an email as the action, and I'm going to type in my email address. I'm going to click on create action, verify my applet, and click finish. To manage the applets, click on my applets, and you'll see all your created recipes here. Thanks for watching, and have fun.